all right what is going on welcome to the channel everyone so this is gonna be a first impressions drive of version 12 and this is literally my second drive ever using version 12 and in this video we're gonna try to get to the other side of the shopping center and get to chick-fil-a and if anyone knows this area this shopping center is super complex and it's very busy and we're gonna attempt this from the park position with a car already starting our video just like this so here we go from the park position and this is v12 trying to navigate through a few shopping centers in a very busy parking lot here we go so i've got the navigation set um it's trying to take me to the chick-fil-a which if anyone knows it's on the completely other side of the shopping center you literally have to get like on this little main pass area to get around from shopping center to shopping center so let's see fsd try to figure its way through all of this since already this is going to be a pretty impossible turn to make um even with humans uh so let's see what it does this is gonna as you can see the brakes already trying to figure out what to do in this situation it's trying to figure out a trajectory on where to go. This car is blocking it. It knows it has the right of way right now. It's kind of not sure what to do. These cars are like all camping, trying to wait for this light. So this is a really interesting scenario. What FSD is actually going to do in this situation. All right, here we go with the green light. And now this car is throwing it off. So now it's going to wait for this car to go. And now since it knows it has the right, Oh my gosh, I cannot believe it figured it out and it went left. It had the right of way and it did it exactly how it was supposed to do and it waited for the right time to do it. I am in shock. Version 11 would have never done that in a million years. That was a super hectic, complex situation. Cars were coming from all directions. Wow. I don't know how I figured it out, but it did. And it did better than some people would do. People would freak out in that situation and not make the left and switch and go right or do. I was about to just take over, but wow. Okay, here we go with the stop sign. You can see the traffic coming in from Route 7. It's it's keeping in count for all of that. This guy's got to stop, so technically he has the right of way. And then it's my turn, so Tesla should know, but this person is pushing his way through. Now they have the right of way. Tesla is keeping now. He flashed me. So now we're both moving. All right. I, I would have went the exact same moment. There was no difference there with everything going on. There was um, a lot of traffic, a lot of right of way situations there. So I was telling you that this video is going to be super hectic because we're, we're talking about a super busy parking lot, like around 6, 7 o'clock p.m. Everyone's getting off work people are just not trying to deal with computers driving right now and automated cars so let's see we should be able to figure this car out um good thing fsd knew what i was doing by waving that car go and really nice job figuring out this left i like the line is very um more detailed in the turns as you can see as it's making that turn it's, it's like more scribbled in a sense where it's like showing every little steering wheel turn angle that it's gonna take and look at this really tight turn that it's taking within the parking lot wow and here's the chick-fil-a in front of us so just an amazing job it did getting through all of this craziness like look at this person trying to get into the drive-through for the dunkin donuts but can't and now fsd is going to try to figure out what they're trying to do and now look they need to reverse once again and fsd still no take no takeovers in this video whatsoever and i'm just truly amazed by this i don't know what it's going to do about getting me exactly to chick-fil-a how it's going to drop me off i'm just going to let it rock and see what it does because i'm just in a maze right now normally i would take over in these critical situations and just be annoyed that you know fsd can't figure it out but it's so decisive right now i i'm just in shock like this is like it's so impressive look at it getting out of the way you know this is it's it's 
very aware and conscious of where it's at it's it's you know moving it's it's changing to the dynamics of the road really well i'm really surprised on how quick it's able to figure out what types of roads it's on and look at these really tight tight turns that i'm having it do and it's figuring it out no different than a human would i mean seriously if you're familiar with these shopping centers you know how much of how annoying it is to get from one end to the other let's see if figure these people out trying to cross wow such an amazing job with fsd and also not okay here we go with the first takeover in the chick-fil-a parking lot because of the hyundai trying to back up right there fsd may might not have seen him because he was doing some weird backup situation where here we go we're gonna let him in now so what it's gonna do for me now i don't know since here we're at our destination Let's see if it sees like a bunch of parking spot. Will it just go right into the drive-through? That'd be crazy because I did not program it to do that. Um, but look at figured out to go this way. Oh my gosh. If it parks for me, I'm going to be seriously, I will be like stunned. Um, okay. I don't know why now it's making this right. I did not tell it to do that. So now it's just making turns all on its own. It's doing a little bit extra. It already took me to my destination and now it took me away from my destination. Um, so we're gonna let it see what it, it needs to do. It needs to go left here. I believe this is a one way. So map says right, but I'm glad that it went left. Normally V11 would follow the map and go right, but it figured it out perfectly. And let's see, it scoop by this car trying to reverse and this car park. Man, just so many amazing scenarios. It's just executing so well. I am so, shout out to the Tesla Autopilot team. Thank you for sending it my way. I'm so happy to receive this. The I'm, I'm gonna be bringing you lots of videos coming up soon. So make sure you subscribe to the channel. Hit that like button if you enjoyed this video. So it does look like it's going to go in circles now, and I'm just going to go ahead and take over and park. Um, and it does look like the auto park situation is completely gone from the cars now, which is crazy for anyone that paid for that, that has ultrasonic sensors. Maybe now the time is the time you're going to realize that they've officially clicked them off. Um, and I'll be updating you real soon on to how it works with the uh, uh, summon as well with actually smart summon coming really soon thanks again for watching hopefully you enjoyed this video this was a blast to shoot um, and i hope you have a great rest of your day